Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be unboxing my Look Fantastic box for the month of December 2021. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. It helps me a ton. This month's box is pink and kind of like purpley. Super cute. A surprise they didn't go with like a more holiday theme, but still cute. A sparkle this festive season and have a very merry Christmas with love from Team Beauty Box. Then inside we've got the tissue paper. Okay guys, so I'm feeling a little bit better about this month's box. The past few months I've been very unhappy, mainly because of like, it's been like value wise. I feel like a lot of the products we've been getting, they're not even like trial size, they're like sample size. And you can pay a few more dollars for a subscription box to get full size products. So that's why I've been a little bit disappointed. But anyways, let's just go ahead and get right into it. So the first item I see in here is by Hollywood Browser. And this is a hair remover and dermaplaning tool. It shapes your eyebrows and removes peach fuzz. That's what it looks like. So you do have to be careful when you're using this at home. You're supposed to do it at a certain degree on your skin and you're also not supposed to do it like very often because it's very exfoliating on your skin and you want to make sure that you're using like a serum or a lotion or something with it. It does sit on the directions to do it on dry skin. So I'm going to have to look more into that guys. I thought you're supposed to do it on on like damp skin so I'll update that in the description when I find out. I have a few of like these razors that I use on my brows but I don't actually have one for face and brow I don't think so I'm excited to try it out. Next product we've got in here I feel like I have gotten so many of these. This one's actually really nice super cute. Last one I got from a subscription box or no it was from an advent calendar. I was disappointed just because the mask was not even the way that it is here. It feels really nice and silky and soft and it's very light. This is by Glove and it's their satin sleeping mask. Sleep like a queen and wake up as a goddess. And it's got a very thin band that's very stretchy on the back. Yeah, I don't really use sleeping masks too much, but maybe I'll try this one out and see if it's any good. The next product that we have in here is the Starship VIP, the Gold Mask Eye Revitalizing Luxury Gold Foil Eye Mask. And it says it's non-water based, which is interesting. It's 83% rose of Jericho based interesting. I feel like there's got to be some water in it though. I like that. I'm excited to try these. We've got a, a makeup item in here and this is by Lottie London and this is their ombre blush. It looks like a really pretty blush. You can definitely see the ombre. It's a little bit lighter, a little bit darker. It's not like a crazy intense ombre or anything like that, but it's a really pretty peachy shade similar to the one I have on from Natasha Denona. I like this color, pretty cute. And then the last item we've got in here is by Elemis. This is their Pro Collagen Energizing Marine Cleanser, and this is anti-aging. Great, I love Elemis products. And it's like a travel size, it is one ounce. Honestly guys, this box was a lot better than I was expecting. And I don't know if it's just because it's the holiday time or what, this was a good box. I think I got my value in this box. Some of the other ones, not so much it's been really like hit or miss like you'll get a really good box and then like it won't be up to par in my opinion for a few months and then it gets good again so it's just i don't know it just depends i did get a few in a row that were good we all have our personal preferences but that is my box for this month and i hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing let me know your thoughts on this subscription box i have a few more boxes coming from them i like this one definitely brought the holiday cheer and smile to my face this month and I like the assortment of products. I do feel like most of their products though, there's not too much makeup in here. It's more like skincare, personal care. Honestly, look fantastic. I feel like it's more skincare based than anything. There's not really ever too much makeup in here. I'm even surprised we got the blush this month. So if you do like a makeup subscription, you probably wouldn't like this. But if you like little tiny samples, trial sizes, and skincare, you might like it. I also wanna put a quick update in here. I won't have any shout outs for like the next two videos or so, just because these are all like pre-recorded, pre-done for this week for the holidays. So I didn't have to film too much during the holidays. So I will be back up and running with the shout outs next week. Let me know your thoughts down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button and turn your post notification bell on so you guys are updated every time I post a new video. Love you guys, bye.